My name is Christopher Kennedy Lawford. I'm an advocate for uh, substance abuse disorders and recovery. Um, also, the physical illnesses that usually follow people in uh, into recovery, uh, uh, like hepatitis C and HIV. My 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 story is definitely universal. I mean, I, my as I said in my book, symptoms of withdrawal. My 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 circumstances are different, as are everybody's. But the underlying stuff, the underlying human stuff. Um, and the underlying uh, addictive stuff is the same. When you walk down a road of alcoholism or drug addiction, your behavior changes so that you can do what you need to do to get high. Now, it's a medical, it's a physiological, it is absolutely, nobody out there can understand, unless they walk in the shoes of an addict or alcoholic, what that compulsion feels like. It's not just about just saying no. Addicts and alcoholics can't just say no. If they could, they would, trust me. Because addiction is like dancing with an 800 pound gorilla that's punching you in the face. And people out there have, a, have this attitude that, you know, alcoholics are, you know, they don't have no willpower, they're morally non-committal, they're kind of weak. You show me anybody that's danced with an 800 pound gorilla that's been punching you in the face for 20 years and lived to tell their story, and I will show you one committed, willful, strong human being. And that's what I found in recovery. I mean, people that get to recovery, they have a lot of things to overcome in terms of life skills and those kinds of things. But once they do, they can be enormously productive. And that's what I'm talking about. We're missing a lot of our society because we've just given up. And, I'm, and when people see me, they go, maybe we shouldn't give up.